Dracaris. Sip. Squeal. Uh-uh. Westeros. Lannister. Dracaris. Sip. And now, the six merry murderesses Squeal. of the Seven Kingdoms. Uh-huh. In their rendition of Westeros. the Red Keep Tango. Lannister. Dracaris. Sip. Squeal. Uh-uh. Westeros. Lannister. Dracaris. Sip. Squeal. Uh-uh. Westeros. Lannister. Dracaris. Sip. Squeal. Uh-uh. People have these little habits that get you down. Like Krasnus. Krasnus like to sell people. No, not sell. Enslave. So I came to Astapol this one day, and I'm feeling disrespected, and I'm looking for 8,000 unsullied. And there's Krasnus, speaking low Valerian and selling. No, not selling. Enslaving. So I said to him, I said, you enslave a man one more time. And he did. So I took control of them all, brought in Drogon, and with one word, burned off his head. He had it coming. He had it coming. He deserved to be in flames. If you'd have been there, if you'd have seen it, I bet you you would have done the same. I met Joffrey Baratheon from King's Landing after the Battle of Blackwater, and he told me he was a king, and we were married right away. So we had our wedding. There was a feast, a dwarf play, he'd sip wine, we had a pie. And then I found out, king, he told me, king my ass. Not only was he not Baratheon, oh no, he had blonde hair, one of those Lannisters, you know. So later, when he was sipping his wine, he realized his drink was a little unusual. You know, some guys just can't hold their strangler. He had it coming! He had it coming! He crushed a flower growing strong! I didn't do it! But if I'd done it, how could you tell me that I was wrong? Standing in the castle, having a drink before dinner, minding my own business, in storms my husband, Robert, in a jealous rage. You've been screwing your brother, he says. He was crazy, he kept screaming, you've been screwing your twin brother. Then he ran into that boar. He ran into that boar ten times. If you'd have been there, if you'd have lived it, I bet you you would have played the game. What am I doing here? They say I stabbed Rinley in the back, but it's not true. I'm innocent. I was guarding his tent. I loved him. I defended him. I don't know where the shadow came from, but it just vanished. How do you fight a shadow? I tried to explain to the other King's guards, but they didn't believe me. I had to run. Yeah, but did you do it? Uh-uh. Not guilty. My captor, the Hound, and I are heading to my aunt's, and my sword Needle is out there somewhere. Now, every night before I go to bed, I have this little prayer I say. Joffrey, Cersei, Ilian Payne, the Hound, Polliver, the Mountain. Six names, one right after the other. So this one day in our journey, we're traveling around Westeros, 
The two of us are arguing. He's demanding chickens and I want a horse. So we go out to get one. We go to a tower, open the door, and there's Needle with his Lannister card. It's number five, Polliver. Well, I was in such a state of shock, I completely blacked out. I can't remember a thing. It wasn't until later, when I was washing the blood off Needle, I even knew he was dead. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. They only have they only themselves to blame. If you'd have been here, if you'd have, been here, if you'd have lived it, if you'd have lived I bet you you would have played the game. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. They only have themselves to blame. If you'd have been here. Tyrion Lannister more than I could possibly say. He was a real romantic guy, sensitive, a dwarf, but he was always trying to find himself. He'd go out every night looking for himself, and on the way, he found Tisha, Aliaya, Sansa, and Bronn. I guess you'd say we broke up because of irreconcilable differences. He set me aside, and I set him up. The Game of Thrones! Jacaris. Sip. Squeal. Uh-uh. Westeros. Lannister. 